What is that? What is that? Look at those. TB Wooden Creations. How much? How much? Sold. Is that Groot with an axe? What is that? Groot apparently has an axe handle or an axe blade. If you're, oh, what is that? What is going on there? Can you even see that? What is, what is that? It's for sale by owner. Is that, the, is that haunted? Shrunken heads and other amazing exhibits. Oh my gosh. Paranormal activity possible. What? I'm just, oh, what is that? Folk Life Center, and there is a boat in the middle of their yard. Okay, I am on my road trip to Chicago, and I found this little, it said Museum of Oddities, along the side of the road along my trip, and um, it doesn't appear to be open, and I really can't even find it, but I've stumbled across this town called Metamora in Indiana. And oh my gosh, is this place amazing. Um, this is, I'm gonna have to come back. This is gonna be a whole day here. Luckily, it's really close to where my mother-in-law lives. So next time I come up and visit with my wife, I'm gonna come over here and have a little uh, wander around for the day because oh my goodness, I'm gonna drive through here so you can see some of these things. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I gotta back up and look at this. Look at that place. Look at this place. I mean, look over here. I love this. It's just kitschy and corny, cheesy, uh, touristy. Look at this thing. What is that? The Ben Franklin, just some weird boat, just beached here in this creek. Can you even see that? Oh my goodness. Look over here, look Look at this. Look at this on this side. I gotta back up so you can see this. There is, looks like apparently, is this a museum of cookie? Of cookie jars? Look at this, can you see this? Look at that. How awesome is that? Okay, I'm gonna get turned around here because there's there's so much more. There's so much in here. Let's turn around here, look at, I guess, the Ben Franklin a little closer. I can't see him. Uh, yeah, you can see it. Can't really see on my phone because of the sun. Okay, there's a sign here. It says there's a gem mine over there. Can you see that in the right-hand corner of the phone? There's a gem mine down there. So you can mine for gems. And look at this. What is this? Haunted Tour of Metamora. Oh my gosh. I am so in for that. Please call for tickets. I will definitely be calling for tickets whenever that's happening. Village Whimsy this way. Yes, it is. Oh my gosh, this place is amazing. What is that? Mrs. Fudge's Confectionery. Yes, please. Okay, the Village Whimsy is apparently a handcrafted boutique. I thought it was just describing the village because that's what this is. Just all kinds of whimsy. That's a better word for it. Not uh, cordy and cheesy. It's whimsy. This That's what, canal shops. And look at this guy out front. Hello, how are you doing? Now, but look, there's a big, there's a nice covered bridge up there on the hill. All right, I'm gonna, I guess this is the end of the fun. I'm gonna flip her around. Oh, I'm some, somebody's yard, sorry. Forgive me, sir. It looks like that's train tracks up there going under that covered bridge. I don't know if you can see that off to the right. Um, okay, yeah, the boat in the canal is just off to the right of that, so the creek and canal goes beside the train tracks. And 
There's a little, just these neat little shops. Let me flip around this way. It's back here. It's got a little uh, cafe. Frank and Diane's unique gifts. Well, if it's coming from this town, I'm sure it's going to be unique. Mount. Okay. Looks like we just got um, homes back here. Oh, looks like there's little cabins. Can you rent these? Looks like that's something for rent. Maybe somebody's apartment. I don't know. Um, what's up this way? Anything up that, that street? Doesn't appear to be. Looks like it just is a little alleyway. It goes back to the street. We already came down. Look at this. There's a cabin in the middle of the road. What is this cabin? What is this cabin? I need to see what this is. There's a sign here that says, Wall Walkway to Duck Creek Shops. It says this, oh, this is a walkway, and I'm on the walkway. Look back in there. There's things to, oh, there's the, the Welcome Duck Creek Shops back there. You can see it very deep right there is the little sign for it. Um, I guess you can't drive back there, so that's going to be on my walking day. But look at look at this cat these cabins back here. Look back over there. That red building off to the right, it says Mr. Ed's shop. Okay. I am so curious. Is that referring to the talking horse? Anybody watching this even remember what that talking horse does? Anybody remember the talking horse? There is a oh kebab, egg roll, and fried rice. That seems out of place. Yeah, let's get backed up here and flip it back around. Don't hit a pole, don't hit a pole. All right, come back up here. Oh, this place is called, can you even see it? Come on, I got, I'm gonna take it out. I gotta take it out. That is the best name for anything. Look at this. The Smelly Gourmet. Any other place that I would avoid that restaurant, but in a place like this, that sounds like it's probably the best place to eat in town. <laughs> uh, I don't know. The smell. Oh, there's the main sign for it out front here. I'm gonna go back around this way. There's the front for it. I was, I guess I was at the back. Look at that, the smelly gourmet. Metamora Public Library, look at this. Isn't that awesome? Look, oh, the little house looks like the big house. And that, that's the, it says public library, little free library book. And right there, if I could pull it up here, look at this. Kissing booth, five cents. Seems like a good deal. There's railroad crossing, another little shops, another restaurant, it just says restaurant. And it has a covered wagon for pulling horse and buggy on the porch. And look at this, we got free parking, more shops and restaurants, state historical site. Oh, so many wonderful gems back here. Look at this. I love this so much. What is that? Prairie Winds Mercantile. Oh, that's ice cream and ham and cornbread. That's a good combination. I hope it's not the flavor of the ice cream. What is this? What's this? Barn Stable Cafe. Spices, dip mixes, candles, primitive items, oil and oil burners, collectibles, and something for everyone. Yes, please. Okay. All right. Going over here by the railroad tracks a little more. Opry Barn. What is an Opry Barn? Okay, that's just a barn back over there. I don't know what it has to do with the Opry. Like the Grand Old Opry in Nashville, Tennessee. That's the other direction. 
It's like it's like a whole little village back here. Okay, I gotta go back here. How far can we drive through? What is this? New parking, okay. Laundry room, what? Oh, man, this is amazing. What is going on? It's like an old timey slash old west village. The wooden melon. If we're not open, we're not selling. Gotcha. Look at that. There is a rocking horse on the porch, the upper porch. What is this? Now and then, like I said, it's an antique shop. I'm getting real excited here. I don't know why I'm so excited, but I'm loving this. Look at that. Hey, how are you going to sit in that rocking chair? That is way up there. Circle Candle Company in this barn here. Connie's Cabin. Well, Connie, I will be back to visit you. Here's the back side of those cabins I was looking at. Oh, there's that walkway, the back of the walkway that I was pointing to earlier. I don't know what goes on at Connie's Cabin. There's no really indication it's a mystery. I'll have to find out. There's Mr. Ed's shop over here to the left. And there is a little horse on that little thing above the doorway. So, horse. Of course. What we got over here? What is this? Family Tough. That looks like more cabins, possibly apartments. They still have their Christmas lights up, which is amazing in February, almost March. Back over here at this restaurant that just says restaurant. <laughs> it's so much. I want to live here. Close enough to Indianapolis where if I miss city life, I could go visit something in the big city, but in between, I'm going to live here. Oh, what is that? What is going on there? Can you even see that? What is, what is that? It's for sale by owner. Is that, the, is that haunted? There's the Welcome to the Dark Shadow. Check out our authentic shrunken heads and other amazing exhibits. Oh my gosh. Children welcome with adult supervision. Warning. Paranormal activity possible. What? For rent, for sale? Only $99,000? What is in this? I need to see what's inside. I might be interested. I have to get the phone out of the holder because I just, I can't contain my excitement. There's a little, uh, bridge here walking over to some other more shops we're gonna have to flip around and see gold diggers family diner another fun little restaurant the train place come on son don't be a turd show me what you're working with here Martha Jane's, whatever that is. It's a big purse for the uh, sign. That's for sale, too. Is this whole town for sale? Oh, we're back over here to the, um, the paranormal tours. Can I buy the whole town? I want to live here. I don't... I'm, it looks like it might be... Oh, I don't know. I'm not even going to venture a guess. To me, it's just too amazing to try to guess what's going on here. I just, I want to come back. I want to walk in all these shops. I want to go on a paranormal tour. 
I want to go on that boat that's apparently on a dry riverbed. Uh, Canal Town Diner. There's another little restaurant here. Uh, what is that? What is that? Look at those. TB Wooden Creations. How much? How much? Sold. I need Hulk. Is that Groot with an axe? What is that? Groot apparently has an axe handle. Or a an axe blade. No, there's no trespassing on that one. Mount Holland House. Gift shop, gym mine, rock shop, snack bar. I guess where the, this is the gym mine is somewhere. I don't see a gym mine yet. Yeah, what, there's a, like a, a little baby water tower. In the cute. Okay. Stop it, phone. gazebo. I don't know if you just saw that back there to the left. It was like a little I don't know if it's supposed to be a waterfall, but it looked like it was waterfalling off the side of that. Okay, I have to go up the hill just a little bit here because there is a lovely pink domicile. Can you see this? Look at this. Ooh, kind of precarious. Look at that. That looks like it could be abandoned too. Like a little dollhouse. Look at this. Yeah, the front of it definitely looks like it's been abandoned. Or maybe not. It's just a little run down, but it's it's adorable. And these, look at these old wrought iron gates or these fences around here. Look at that. Stop it, phone. Put the window down. Look at this. Nice view over the back of that thing. Look at that. I love it. I want a honeymoon here. I've already had my honeymoon. I've already been married. I so I can't, but I, I want to do it again. I want to come here. Okay, how do I get down this hill? I'm up the hill and I can't get down the hill. I don't know how to get down the hill. I'm gonna have to go home and look up the history of this place and the current status of it because I have no idea this is just like a, a summer place, or oh, look at this, just into the side of the, the wall there. Cedar side farm. Okay, anyway, I got distracted. I got a little ADD, I guess. Squirrel! No, it probably is a squirrel. I didn't, I didn't see it, but I'm just saying squirrel. Um, I, yeah, again, I don't know the status of this place currently. I don't know the history of this place. I don't know if it's just open in the summers. I don't know if it was open, by, if it was owned by one person and they decided just to shut the whole thing down and now it's why everything's for sale. I don't know. I'm guessing. I'm speculating. I'm just, oh, what is that? Folk Life Center. And there is a boat in the middle of their yard. There's a houseboat in the yard of the Folk Life Center. I guess you can walk up. Oh. What in the world? How did it get there? Okay. Metamora, there's a sign there. Can you see it? it says platted. What does platted mean? Is that misspelled? Should it say planted? 1838. Metamora Gemini. Get this over here. See that Gemini's that way. I don't see anything. That was maybe where that uh, little baby water tower was. It's kind of back in that direction. Okay. Well, there's, okay. Just in case, for your blacksmithing needs, 
There's also a blacksmith shop here in town. And, um, hog roasts, apparently. Okay, I'm gonna have to continue northward um, on my trip. But, oh, I'm glad I stopped through here. This is awesome, and I am definitely gonna have to come back. Um, if you can get here before I do, send me a link, something. Somebody know anything about this? Talk to me, send me a message. But, uh, Metamora, Indiana. Wow. Oh, just one last thing. Look at this. There's there's the Metamora sign, but there's a snowman. A snowman. I think a permanent snowman just there on the side of the road. I guess a greeting usually come into Metamora. I think it's made of wood too, it's carved. Probably for the same people that made the Hulk sculpture. Hey buddy, see you later, I'll be back.